Finally made it to the airport. Uh, my flight, my flight doesn't leave until about 30 minutes, so I'm about to board in a minute. But I like how I got these two antennas just sticking up. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so I'm, I'm I'm pretty excited. I have not flown since July. Um, yeah, I haven't flown since July. Uh, when I went to see Don Tolliver down in down in Houston, so that was a uh, yeah, that was July. So I'm I'm pretty excited to get back in the sky and get back to flying and you know what I do best, I guess. I am pretty hungry. I I haven't eaten I haven't eaten anything today. I had a I had some um, almond uh, eggnog. Yeah, I had some almond eggnog earlier this morning, but that was it. So, and I probably won't eat until seven or so. So, I'm probably gonna be hangry in this video. So just, just excuse me if I am. Yeah, I'm excited, man. Yeah, it's been, it's been a while. Um, it's a random lady. Uh, it's been a while. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited. But um, excuse me for this horrible angle. But when you have people in, in public, it's just like. You know, talking to a camera. I don't know. I think the more, the more that I do talk to the camera, the more like confidence I build. I guess with it, like, because it doesn't matter at the end of the day. Like, at the most, they just know I'm vlogging, or they know I'm like a YouTuber, a streamer, something like that. I guess this is what people. I guess this is what people think nowadays. So, but hey, he just said that the plan was full and. Again, I've never been on United, but it seems like a pretty small plane. Like, it's only maybe not even 40 people here, I'd assume. Like, not even 40. But, yeah, should be fun. I'll see you guys when I touch down. Um, I'm about to put this back up so I can uh, put back up my iPad and everything that was charging. So, but yeah, I'll see you guys uh, 
either in Houston or I'll probably wait until Louisiana, most likely. Finally, finally made it to Shreveport. I just called a lift, waiting on a lift to pick me up. So, I'll be home with my family in about 10 minutes. Excited. Shreveport still look the same. Well, at least this area does, but. Say, say what's up, Mike. What's up? <laughs> what the the mic you have? Yeah. I'm here with a um, professional uh, model from uh, from LA. Uh, <laughs> Not LA. <laughs> from LA, I'm here with the uh, Ma Matthew Banks. Uh, let me see. You might have seen him. He's done uh, multiple brands. He's been with. What? What I've been with? Introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Matthew. <laughs> Mac put us on the spot, if you didn't know, uh, with the camera. But we here. And yet, look, yes, I do model. He's, he's speaking into existence, maybe my future, okay? I could be in LA or New York, okay? I got the turtleneck to represent my neck. You see it? The neck? My okay. God. <laughs> Do hey, hey, you're right, you're right. In a city near you, he's coming. Hi, I'm book him today. Look. And we have the uh, <clears throat> doctorate. Um, oh. Let me see, what else? Uh, <laughs> it's the smoke world. Hold on, wait. Come on. It's the smoke We have the, the doctorate, musician, talented, uh, baker, whatever you need, builder. Mr. McCoy, Mr. McCoy, stylist, hairstylist. Hello, I am Timothy McCoy, and I am, I am. This is this is my best friend, one of my best friends right here, both of them, and we love this man. Okay, so yes. So yeah, I recently just made it back to my mother's house. If you couldn't tell, um, I just hung out with some old friends, and it was great. It was really really good. We called up you know we talked about just a lot of different things and yeah man I had such a great time honestly I hadn't seen one of them in six years and I hadn't seen the other one since February of this year and before that it, w it had been a couple of years so it was just we all kind of just picked up where we left off pretty much I'm going to be here at my mom's house for probably two hours and then Go hang with some more friends, probably in a couple of hours. But in the meantime, I wanted to finish listening to this audiobook that I, I recently started. It's called The Art of Happiness by the Dalai Lama. Dalai Lama. And uh, it's a very interesting read. It It's not, I mean, it's very practical too. I'll say that. Like I know sometimes uh, happiness can be a tricky subject to to get a reader to really, it's hard, it's hard to convey happiness in a book because, you know, it's, it's subjective. But I think, I think this book is is well thought out, and I'm about eighty five percent done. I think it's a uh, around eight hours, um, front to front to end, eight hours. But like I said, I'm about eighty five percent done. So I wanna, I wanna listen to it a little bit more because it's it's been helping me. It's it's primarily based around work and how to deal with work and the, the, the happiness that you can get from day to day, again, which is why it's very practical. But nonetheless, today has been great. Just to update you guys, it's been, it's been pretty good. You know, I flew earlier, so that was, that was fun because I hadn't flown in a while. And... Yeah, I got to see both of my sisters earlier and my brother-in-law. Yeah, just, I mean, it's it's been a great day. I haven't had any urges to binge anything. As far as eating, I've I've had uh, rice from Pan Express. I did have some rice. And I had some cauliflower wings. 
and I just had a slice of pie that my my aunt made from scratch, uh, some sweet potato pie, and I was like, I have to eat that. I'm sorry, like <laughs> I've been in a good mental space all day, and so I think that that's that's a uh, that's a good thing. It's a very good thing. So um, hopefully you guys are also being conscious not only in what you eat and has nothing to do with like dietary um, selection, but more so just conscious of your thoughts, conscious of how you're moving today, because again, it's day one. And so again, over the next 29 days, I want to really focus on, yes, working on my goals and hobbies. Yes. You know, self-actualization, but also realizing that step by step by step, right? It's a learning process. It's not going to come overnight, but it's a learning process, right? And first day, not over yet, but it has been great. I just want to encourage you guys, again, if, if you're on the same path to keep going forward, just focus on being the best version that you can be, honestly. 